Cole is my favorite. Uh, if y'all didn't know that, J. Cole is my favorite artist all the time. Um, he just dropped another single-ish type thing. I don't know if it's a part of a future project, but you know he ran them and he come out with an album about September-ish time. So, we're just going to enjoy this while he gave it to us. But before we get this video started, you know what I'm saying? Hit up my bros. I'm going to put their Instagram right here. Black owned young kings, entrepreneurs, you know what I'm saying? Shop with them. This is a quality Thick crew neck. They got a whole bunch of merch on their Instagram. They got a whole bunch of merch on their page. So, go to their Instagram. Show them some love. But let's get into the video. I'm going to be reacting to J. Cole's Middle Child. As you know, this just dropped. So, we're going to get right into it. You got too much. First take, I ain't listening to none yet, so let's go. Nigga, they count me up. I'm counting my bullets. I'm loading my clips. I'm writing down names. I'm making a list. I'm Ooh. checking the and I'm getting them hit the real. <laughs> he off wreck on rip, bro. What? He come off talking about, look, this is what I'm doing. You feel me? You, you disrespect me in any type of way. Okay? Pencil that in. Okay? But best believe. It's coming back to you. Like, what's up? Dying, the fake was as lit. The game is off balance. I'm back on my shit. The bitly is dirty. My sneakers is dirty. But that's how I like it. You all on my dick. I'm up. <laughs> Listen, listen. I don't care how it appearances, you know what I'm saying? You know that I'm doing what I gotta do. You feel me? Don't worry if my shoes is hit. But I'm bringing that bars back. I'm bringing the game back to you. I'm ready. I do not throw powder. I might take a sip. I might oh. Oh. But I'm not for the trip. I ain't coming no deal. But you do as you wish. I roll with some things. I love them to death. I got a few mil, but not all of them rich. What good? <laughs> I rock with you, but I don't do what you do, bro. That's it. Bread if my niggas is broke, we'll get us first class if my niggas can't sit. That's my next mission, that's why I can't quit. Just like LeBron, get my niggas more chips. Just put the rolly right back on my wrist. This you gotta put your team on. I'm apologizing now for pausing as much as I am because I can't get copyrighted. You feel me? I gotta get the reaction out to where I can receive from this. So just know reactors have to pause for copyright purposes. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but we're gonna do bar by bar. That's how it's gonna be. It's gonna be real beef. We not playing that internet trolling. We not six nine in the situation. You know what I'm saying? We out here really with this. You feel me? Okay. We really with that stuff. Don't come for me. <laughs> Cause it's gonna be beef. You hear me? To sell you my latest little sneakers, it won't be cause some niggas slid in my lane. Everything grows, it's destined to change. I love you little niggas, I'm glad that you came. I hope that you scrape every dollar you came. I hope you no money won't erase the pain. To the I'm learning that, bruh. Being raised in money and understanding that the fact that it don't cover up all the scars that you have dealt with in your past or all the stuff that you really physically dealt with or emotionally have dealt with due to your circumstances of growing up. Like, just because you got a check don't mean everything okay. Like, money can solve some problems, but it don't solve all the problems. Like, if your emotions and your head is not together, money can either tip you off or just make you, you feel me, numb. Jeez, I'm begging you now. I was watching you when you was came in the crown. I copied your cadence. I mirrored your style. I studied the grace. I'm the greatest right now. Fuck if you feel me. Facts. Don't play with me, bro. They came in him wrecked when he dropped KOD like, get Cole falling up, Cole doing... No, Cole been about the action. I'm telling you, don't, don't play my man. Because look... He can switch the flow and still come with y'all with lyrical, you know what I'm saying? I feel with KOD came at the more visual aspect of artistry where he showed y'all the storyline and had the old school like type of um scenery type music videos where it's a whole vibe like but he can you feel me he can come back. You feel me? No questions asked, he's gonna he's gonna do it. I'm counting on Cole this year. Every my money on him every trip. I don't care. I'm not playing with y'all. You feel me? That's the way his hair grew out crazy because y'all know he was coming with the bars, bro. He been struggling, but he not worried about that. He for me, he working, grinding every trip. I just poured something in my cup. 
you want auto tune? What's up? <laughs> Bro, I feel like that's how I am. I'm I'm young, but I have an old mind. So like, I'm in a new generation in terms of technology, but I'm in the old generation in terms of my musical choice and how I think about certain stuff. Like. I'm just riding the fence at this point. Like, I could rock with y'all, but I don't rock with y'all music. But I couldn't be as old school, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm hip with what's going on. Like, I don't know. Like, it sucks because you, you could ride, vibe with both parts at the same time. You just don't feel comfortable in either surrounding, if that makes sense. <laughs> Where the daddy's at? It sucks, but it's the truth of the system and how, you know what I'm saying, it's been pulled apart. And at this point, it's kind of like common sense type vibe. Or it's just a common nature in the black community where the father's just not there. Like, I grew up with my father, kind of. Like, you know what I'm saying? They got divorced when I was six. He moved away when I was 10, but he was still around in a sense. Like, some people don't even know they pops. Like, that's tough. And you don't understand how much it hurts you until later on you see it in relationships or you see it lashing out on people in ways that you didn't really understand or cultivate when you were young, bro. It sucks. You know what I'm saying? It's something else we got to deal with in order to be great. And it's just like, for why? No sisters, the babies is real. We killing our brothers, they poison the real. Distort the self image, we set up the fair. I'm gonna make sure that the real gon' prevail. Nigga. That's bro. And I see it in the system. Like I work in a prison. If you guys don't know, I work in a prison. Um, I'm the coordinator of education, but I still see the game. I still peep the game. People been in there longer than I've been alive. You know what I'm saying? And they. Happy, cheery, go lucky, because that's what their reality. They have to adjust to that. You know what I'm saying? They did what they did. Okay, cool. But some of the stuff they shouldn't even, you feel me, the time frame on what you did versus, you know what I'm saying? And then you try to get out, and you can't even really get out and do nothing with your life because of you had this label on your life. But it's wreck, I'm telling you. It's wreck. The system is wreck. And my prison does not fit the stereotype of color-wise. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's all types of stuff in there. And the ones that you wouldn't think is there is the majority. So I'm not going to go into that because... I don't got time for y'all to come at me crazy, but just know, the stereotype ain't always the truth. I'm give him Don't come at me, bro. If it come a problem where you gotta defend yourself, okay, you for me, do what you gotta do. But don't just put a thing out just because you can't fight. Don't put a thing out because, you know what I'm saying, you scared of the beef. Like, don't do all that extra stuff and hurt somebody that you don't even have for no, just because, you know what I'm saying, it's dumb. It's dumb, but it goes on, so. <laughs> Yo, I just got hyped. The beat fire, you know what I'm saying, the whole vibe of the song. On top of that, the message hit for what we need to hear now these days, as I said before. Go to their Instagram, show them some love, you know what I'm saying? Cop, cop, they got all the types of designs, all the types of merch. Show them some love. But, if you're new, you know what I'm saying, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that bell button, and stay tuned. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna mix it up with the reaction, I'm gonna mix it up with the pranks and the challenges, you know what I'm saying? But I gotta do it, I gotta do it, I gotta do it. Okay, okay, okay. Bye.